Hey everyone, in today's video I'm gonna show you how you can freeze the panes in your spreadsheet so you can easily identify the meaning of each row or each column. So to do it we have to go to the ribbon and click on view. In view you'll see this button that says freeze panes and as the button says Freeze panes will be freeze a portion of the sheet to keep it visible while you scroll through the rest of the sheet. This is useful for checking out data in other parts of your worksheet without losing your headers or labels. So if we click there, we'll see three options. The, the first one will be keep rows and columns visible while the rest of the worksheet scrolls based on current selection. The second one that frees the top row and the last one that says freeze first column. So let's click on freeze top row. Now you'll see that we have a, a darker line below first name, last name, street address, city, state and zip code. So now if we move through the document we'll always see the top row. The other option is the first column. The process is the same, but now we'll select a third option. And now, if we move the document to the right, we'll always be watching the first name. The last option is freeze both things. In this case, the top row and the first column. So to do it, Select any cell in the spreadsheet and now we have to click on split. What is split? Divide the window into different panes that each scroll separately. So let's click here and now we can move these lines and select which part of the document we want to freeze. So let's keep this line here but just to show you, you can move this and the other line to the top row. Once you've selected this, you have to click on freeze panes. Now we have the darker line here and the other darker line here. And now we can scroll down the document and we will always be watching the top row. And if we move the document to the right, we'll always be watching the first name as well. And that was all for today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. If you want to keep watching and learning from our videos, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.